Good morning, good morning on a very windy day in Surfside Beach, South Carolina. Today's practice will be a one hour yoga slow flow. So roll out your mat, hop on, grab your water bottle, uh, get comfy and come into Sukhasana. Easy pose. Sit up nice and tall. Close the eyes. Roll the shoulders up toward the ears and send them down the back all the while getting active in the shoulder blades. So squeeze the shoulder blades behind you, hug the elbows into the side body and lay the palms on the legs or wherever they're comfortable. You can also take palms up to receive wonderful energy, in my case from Mother Nature. Hopefully you can be outside in your practice. Grow tall through the spine, from the tailbone all the way up to the top of the head. Lift the heart space, retract the chin. Take a nice deep breath in through the nose, let it go through the mouth. Beautiful. Begin to relax, <clears throat> but also engage. As you tap into the breath, breathing in, holding at the top, and then exhaling all the air out through the nose, finding your ujjayi breath, drawing the belly button in toward the spine. Maybe setting an intention for today's class, a word, a thought, or a prayer that you may want to send out to someone else someone you love, someone that may need it in the moment. Maybe your thought, your prayer is for yourself or your immediate family. Just make that intention that you can return to throughout class today to help you keep focused on the breath and your intentions throughout the next hour. Continue to breathe nice and deep, filling the lungs all the way up. And exhaling, all the air comes out. Breathe in peace. Exhale, any stressors, aggravations, or anything that's not serving you in the moment. <clears throat> Continue to breathe. And take three more cleansing breaths here. Gently open the eyes, take a big inhale, all the way to the top. Bring the hands to heart center in prayer. Take a big inhale. On your exhale, we're gonna drop the nose toward the fingertips, dropping the forehead, chin to the chest. Inhale, back to the top. Maybe we look up at the sky. Exhale, round, drop the head. Inhale, come back up, maybe drop the neck back. Check in with your neck, you know, wherever you are today. So if that's not comfortable, just come back to a tall seat. One more time. Inhale, look up. Maybe look back. And come back to a nice tall seat. Take a big inhale all the way to the top. And we're going to take our left hand to the mat. Bring the right hand up and over the ear. And we're going to take a little shoulder, shoulder stretch here on the left side. It's drawing the ear to the shoulder. Be gentle. Your eyes can be opened or closed. And if it's too much of a stretch with your fingertips down, you can always change the level of your lever by lifting the arm to wherever it feels comfortable. Big inhale and exhale. One more big breath. And release. Take it back to the top with an inhale. Exhale, take it to the other side. Right hand comes to the earth, left hand reaches up and over to the opposite ear and draw that ear to the shoulder. Find a big stretch, find a big breath. Relax, unwind.
One more big breath in and out. Hmm. Release. Take another big breath all the way to the top. On your exhale, we're going to take this to a twist. Left hand comes behind, right hand comes up and over the knee. Take an inhale, lengthen, exhale, and twist. Release from your twist, back through center, inhale to the top, exhale and twist to the other side. Inhale, back through center, exhale, twist. Inhale to the top, exhale and twist. Back to center, exhale and twist. Hmm. Really begin to uh, relax, but stay engaged as we breathe in deep. And exhale, remove all negativity, anything that's bothering you, let it go. One more time, we'll come back to the top, exhale and release. And then release from your twist, come back through center, take the legs wide. Whatever wide means to you today. And we'll roll the shoulders back on an inhale. On your exhale, walk the fingertips out in front of you. And begin to come into your forward wide-legged folds. On your inhale, reach out long through the crown of the head. Keep that beautiful axial extension long in the head. So imagine someone is holding your head and pulling it straight out from the spine. Little tug and then on your exhale, let gravity do some work. Maybe you fall in a little bit further. And when you've found your sweet spot, if you like, feel free to drop your head, chin toward the chest, relax for just a moment. You can stack the fists here or the hands, and relax in, whatever works. A couple nice deep breaths. One more, big breath in and out. Hmm. Gently start to look up. Bring the fingertips to the earth. Press yourself back to a seat. Beautiful, big inhale all the way to the top. Exhale, take left hand to the earth. Right hand reaches up and over into a side stretch. Inhale back to the top. Exhale, side stretch to the right. Back to the top and side stretch. One more big breath in and a big breath out. Come back to the top. Bring the hands to heart center. Nice. Cross the legs and we are going to come to all fours. So however, you, however you'd like to come to all fours. We'll take tabletop. Find your tabletop position. Tuck your toes, get nice and engaged. And some checkpoints. Tucking the toes, fingers spread wide, wrists right under the shoulders, knees under the hips. Pull the belly button in toward the spine and flatten the back, straighten the spine. Reach long through the crown of the head so it extends straight out from the spine. Press away from the earth with your hands to create space between the shoulders and the ears. And let's take some cat-cow stretches. Inhale, we'll look up, drop the belly. Exhale, round, press away from the earth. Inhale to cow pose. Exhale to cat. Following your breath.
After your next exhale, meet me in tabletop position. Beautiful. And let's take the left foot straight out behind you and tuck the toes. We're gonna press back through that heel. Find a big stretch in the back of the leg and the calf and into the hamstring. Press back, you can press back with the hands a little bit, lengthen and increase that stretch. Release, come back through center. We're gonna lift that heel and we're gonna take that heel over to your right. Drop it off your mat. And then take a peek back at those toes if you'd like. Find a big stretch in the left hip. On an inhale, lift that heel, bring it back through center. And let's take it all the way out to the side. I'm just gonna find an inner thigh stretch today. This is as far as we're going to go with it. Let's just hold here, make sure your ankle is comfortable. Pull the belly in, nice long spine. Maybe walk the foot out. And then take that left leg back behind you. Lift and hold. Take the right arm straight out in front of you. Find balance table. On an exhale, drop it back down to the mat. We're gonna go right to the other side. Left arm lifts, right leg lifts, and return to the mat. Inhale, right arm, left leg. Left arm, right leg. One more, big breath in and big breath out. Meet me back in tabletop. Beautiful, take a cat cow stretch or two. Release the back. Super windy today. And come on back to tabletop. Now we're gonna take that right leg out. Gotta do the other side, right? So extend the right leg long, flex the foot. Press back through the heel. Maybe press back with the hands a little to increase that stretch if it feels good, only if it feels good. Nice, gentle, warm stretch. No pain ever. Hmm. It actually feels really good. Come back through center. We're gonna lift through the heel and we're gonna take those toes over to the left. Drop them off your mat and maybe take a peek back at the toes. Find that big stretch up the right side body. On your next inhale, lift that heel, bring it back through center, and then we're going to take it all the way around to the other side. So right leg extends out to the right side, finding an inner thigh stretch. Just hold here, pull the belly in, shoulders away from the ears. Just enjoy the stretch. And let's lift that leg, bring it back through center. Lift through the heel and drop it back to the mat. Beautiful two cat-cow stretches here. Come on back to tabletop and we're gonna find downward facing dog. Tuck the toes, and here we go. Lift the hips high, drop the head low. Pedal the feet, pedal, pedal, pedal. Breathe, press away from the earth. So when you drop your head low, if you wanna take a moment and pause, and drop your head low, and then press back through the hands so the torso comes closer to the thighs. That's what creates that beautiful V shape that and that little lift in the tailbone. So imagine the tailbone rising up a little bit more to the sky. And you'll feel your down dog change just a little bit. Two more breaths. Beautiful, start to look up at your hands. Take a slow, determined walk to meet them. And as you're traveling, start to roll up to your fingertips. Big breath in, create a nice long spine. Exhale and fold. On your inhale, tall mountain all the way to the top. Exhale, hands to heart center, soften and fold it down. 
Inhale to a halfway lift. Exhale and fold. Inhale all the way to the top, tall mountain. Hands to heart center, soften and fold it down. Halfway lift and fold. Inhale, tall mountain. Hands to heart center. Soften, fold it down. Halfway lift, fold. Inhale, tall mountain. Adding on, this time cactus the arms, elbows toward the earth. Squeeze the shoulder blades, inhale to the top. Exhale and twist. We'll take the left hand to the front, right hand to the back. Inhale to the top. Left hand to the back, right hand to the front, and your twist to the left. Inhale to the top. Exhale and twist. Finding a flow that matches your breath. One more big inhale and exhale. Final twist. Back to the top. Hands to heart center, soften and fold. Halfway lift, fold it down. Inhale, tall mountain. Exhale, swan dive, forward fold. Halfway lift, exhale, fold. Plant the palms, step it back to low plank. Drop the knees, release the toes. Slowly lower down to the earth. Inhale, mini cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Pedal the feet. And hold here, take a breath or two. Breathe in nice and deep. One more big breath in your downward facing dog. On your inhale, look forward, take a walk to your hands. Exhale and fold. Inhale, tall mountain. Exhale, swan dive, forward fold. Halfway lift. Exhale and fold. Plant the palms, step it back to plank. Your version, high or low. I'm trying to find my happy place here with my mat. Slowly lower down, chaturanga. Exhale on your down dog. Big breath in. <sighs> Inhale, look up at the hands, take a walk to meet them. Exhale and fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, tall mountain. Swan dive, forward fold. Halfway lift, fold it down, plant the palm, step it back to plank, and slowly lower down, or you can skip the vinyasa and go right to down dog. Big breath and downward facing dog. Take a look at the hands and walk to meet them. Exhale and fold. Inhale, tall mountain. Exhale, hands to heart, center in prayer. Hold it here. Take a moment. Regroup. Find your breath. Find your pause. Find your calm. Ooh, the wind is blowing. Relax the shoulders. Close the eyes. Big breath in. On your exhale, tell yourself, I am patient. Inhale. On your exhale, I am calm. Big inhale. Exhale, I am peaceful. 
One more big inhale. On your exhale, I am so very grateful. Gently open the eyes. Take a big breath in. Exhale, hands to heart center. Soften and fold it down. Halfway lift. Fold. Plant the palms. Step back to downward facing dog. Big breath in downward facing dog. And on your next inhale, right leg's gonna lift. Ooh, magnolia tree. Exhale, hug the knee to the chest. Step it through the hands. We're gonna come right up to warrior one. Beautiful, reach up nice and tall. On an exhale, bring the arms forward and then sweep them behind the back. Inhale, reach up, warrior one. Exhale, flat back, reach out and then sweep the hands behind the back. Inhale, back to the top. Come forward, sweep the arms behind. Inhale, back to the top. Keep that left hand going. We're gonna take it to the back leg. Reach up with the right hand. Beautiful, cartwheel the hands to the front. Frame that front foot. Find pyramid pose on the right. Start to straighten that right leg and maybe bow nose to knee. Beautiful, press up to the fingertips. Turn the back toes toward the front and step back to downward facing dog. One more breath. Nice, inhale, left leg lifts. Exhale, hug the knee to the chest, step through the hands. Warrior one. All the way up. Exhale, come to a flat back and then sweep the arms behind you. Keep it going, find that flow. Inhale, come back up, nice and smooth. Nice and graceful, come to a flat back. Sweep the arms behind. Find that energy in that left foot, pressing away from the earth as we travel back to the top. Exhale, flat back and reach behind. Come back to the top this time. Keep that right hand going, send it to the back leg. Reach up with the left hand, look up at the sky. And on your exhale, cartwheel the hands to the front, frame the front foot, hop up with the back foot, find pyramid pose on the left. One more breath. Beautiful, on an inhale, press up to the fingertips, turn the back toes to the front, step up to meet the left foot. Bend the knees generously, lay the torso to the thighs. Come into ragdoll. Let the fingertips graze the earth. Or if you'd like, you can take opposite hand to opposite elbow. You can find stillness here if it works. Whatever, take two big breaths. With the head and arms and fingers dangling, all the weight is just dangling down. We're gonna bend the knees generously and take a slow, juicy roll up all the way to the top and find mountain pose. Come to the top of your mountain pose. Bring your hands to your sides, palms face forward. Eyes are opened or closed, your choice. Ah, feel the wind on your face if you're outside. Ah, appreciate the little things, right? Hmm. One more big breath. Breathe in energy, release any tension. Open the eyes if they're closed, take a big inhale all the way to the top. Exhale, swan dive, forward fold. Halfway lift, fold, plant the palm, step it back to downward facing dog. Beautiful, on an inhale, the right leg's gonna lift. On your exhale, bend the knee, hug it to the chest, shift forward, step through the hands. We'll come to warrior two on your in breath.
Beautiful. Inhale, reach forward. On your exhale, reverse warrior. Gonna have to trim that magnolia. Nice, come back through warrior two. And open your stance. So widen your stance in warrior two. Walk your front foot out, walk your back foot out. And find a nice generous bend in that front knee. Take a big breath in and reach to the front. We're gonna find extended side angle. Drop the fingertips toward the earth and we're gonna open nice and wide. Big breath in. Come back to warrior two arms. Take a reverse warrior. Beautiful, then come back to the top. Arms out to the sides, and we're gonna take the toes to the outer edges of your mat, coming to a wide stance. Big breath in, flip the palms, hands to heart center. On your exhale, we're gonna go to goddess pose. Bend the knees, squat down, palms face each other, elbows out. Big breath in, palms together, exhale, prayer squat. Big breath in, exhale, goddess pose. Big breath in, palms together, exhale, prayer squat. Back to the top. Exhale, goddess. Back to the top. Exhale, prayer squat. Back to the top. And goddess. One more time, we'll come back to the top. Press the palms together. Come into prayer squat, and we're gonna hold. Find a sway if it feels good. Move side to side. Or if you wanna hold, you can lift. Right and left heel. Just find a little bit of movement. Keep the idea of flow and breath work as we strengthen the lower body. You've got this for three, two, one. Bring the hands to the thighs. Come forward and we're gonna take that left shoulder and dip it down across the body, big twist. Inhale, come back to the top. And we'll take the right shoulder, dip it down, cross the body with a twist. Inhale, exhale, twist to the other side. You got this, you've got a flow. Don't even think about those quads right now. Back to the top. One more time, right shoulder dips. Back to the top. And then come all the way up, five point star. Boy, doesn't that feel good. Hands to heart center. Beautiful. Bring the arms out to your sides. And we're gonna take the right toes, point them out to the right side of your mat. We're gonna bring that left foot to warrior two and open your stance. Bend in the front knee. Find a nice strong warrior two. On your inhale, reach forward and then send it back. Reverse warrior. Back through warrior two. And then we're gonna find that nice long side angle. Reaching for the sky with the left fingertips. Big breath in. Come on back, warrior two arms. Take one last reverse. Back through warrior two. Face me, toes to the corners of your mat. Big inhale. Exhale, prayer squat. Inhale, five-pointed star. Exhale, prayer squat. Inhale. Exhale, prayer squat. One last time, there's squirrels playing above my head. I might just like this nature yoga. One more. Exhale, prayer squat. Beautiful, hold here for three, two, one. Drop the fingertips to the earth. Straighten the legs ever so slightly or all the way, if it works, right? Whatever works for you. Big breath in, exhale, release. 
wide-legged forward fold. Find comfort in your fold here. Just take a moment to breathe and relax. Breathe nice and deep. One more breath in wide-legged forward fold. Next inhale, press up to the fingertips. Walk the hands to your right. Frame the right foot. Turn those toes so the toes and the heel and the ankle and the knee are all in alignment. So you can be on the fingertips or if you'd like to bow nose to knee here, you can. How about a little bit of a flow? Plus, press up to the fingertips. Exhale and bow. Inhale, press up. Exhale and bow. One more. Inhale, press up. Exhale and bow. This time, inhale, press up. We're going to walk our hands all the way to the other side. Listen to the birds playing. This is kind of awesome, right? Frame the left foot this time. Hold here, maybe bow, nose to knee. Whatever feels good to you today. And we'll play a little bit. Press up to the fingertips. Big inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, press it up. Exhale and fold. Inhale, press it up. Exhale and fold. Press it up one last time and walk the hands back through center. Beautiful. Pull the belly in. Bring the hands to the hips. Come up to a stand. Lovely. Big inhale all the way up. Exhale, arms to the side, flip the palms down, come to a flat back. Bring the hands over the head, let the palms touch, and bring them back to the side. Pull the belly in, don't let your belly hang on your thighs. Bring the hands to the front, pull the belly in. Exhale, take them to the side. One more time, bring the hands to the front. Exhale, bring the hands to the side, big breath in. Exhale, flop it down. Beautiful, press up to the fingertips. Bring the hands to the hips and come back to a stand. Nice. Big breath in. Exhale, warrior two on your right. One breath. And then cartwheel the hands to the front. Plant the palms. Step back to plank. And you can take high or low plank here. If you want to lower the knees, you can. And we're going to hold plank. Just for five, four, three, two, and one. Lower the knees, release the toes, and then softly lower to the mat. Bring the elbows out wide. Stack the hands. Open the legs a little bit, maybe rock side to side on the hip points. Get comfy. And then release the head. Take a nice big breath in through the nose and let it all go through the mouth. Relax, maybe one more like that. Big breath in through the nose. Exhale through the mouth, release the tension, release the shoulders, release your back. Big breaths in and out. Nice. And on your next in-breath, we're going to get a little bit more active in the legs. So zip up the legs and take the arms behind you, palms face up. Let the shoulders relax just for a moment. Big breath in and out. And on your in-breath, start to look up. We're going to lift the chest, peel up with the chest and lift the toes. Lift the legs as much as they'll come up and then press up with the palms. Take a big inhale, press up, 
Exhale, release to the mat. Inhale, lift up, peel up, press up. Exhale, release. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, release. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, release. One more time. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, release. Bring those hands back under the forehead, elbows to the sides. Take one more big breath in and out. So nice. Bring the hands underneath the shoulders and we'll press back to child's pose. Take a breather, take a breath. Take the knees wide if you'd like. Bring the toes to touch. Press the hips back toward the heels. Walk the hands out or get comfy and take the elbows out wide, your choice. Just get comfortable this time. No crazy engagement in the arms, just whatever feels good. Find your child's pose. And take a moment to yourself to breathe. If you'd prefer child's pose with your knees together, you may always take child's pose that way. Um, find whatever's comfortable and works for you in that particular moment. Breathe nice and deep. One more breath. And then nice and slow, walk the hands under the shoulders. And we're gonna come to tabletop position. From tabletop, walk the knees back just a little bit. Walk the hands so they're under the shoulders. Tuck the toes. We're in low plank. Big inhale. Exhale, lower down, chaturanga. Release the toes. Inhale, mini cobra. Exhale, press back, child's pose. Inhale, we're gonna bring the body through the front. Same thing, come back to low plank. Lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, mini cobra. Exhale, child's pose. Press it back. Inhale, bring the body through the front. Come back through low plank, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, exhale, child's pose. One more time. Inhale, start to look up, shift forward, come to low plank, slowly lower down. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, child's pose. Take two big breaths. Beautiful, walk yourself to tabletop position. Nice, we are going to find modified side plank. Take the right hand to the center of the mat and that right knee and right foot is gonna pivot behind you. Take the left leg straight out in line with the hip. Reach tall for the sky with the left fingertips. Line everything up. And maybe lift the toes. You can gaze up at the fingertips if it feels good. Big inhale. Exhale, drop the toes and take the fingers overhead. Definitely have to trim the magnolia. Inhale, come back to the top, lift the toes. Exhale, release the toes, take the fingers overhead. Inhale, back to the top. Exhale, release. Reach long. One last time. Nice, leave the toes on the ground. Reach back up to the sky. Nice, and then we're gonna power up all the way to the top. Let the hands touch and then bring the hands to heart center. Walk that left knee in. We're gonna take this all to the other side. So we're gonna take that right leg out to the side. Big breath in. On your exhale, left hand comes to the earth. 
right hand reaches up to the sky. We open the right side body and we lift the toes. Big breath in. On your exhale, drop the toes, reach up and overhead. Inhale, reach to the sky, lift the toes. Couple more, reach it up. One last time, reach up, lift up. Release to your stretch. Reach up with the right fingertips, power up to a kneel. Exhale, hands to heart center. And bring the knees together, tuck the toes. And we'll find toes pose for just a moment. Take a big breath in, lift the heart space. Exhale, drop the hips toward the heels. Hang out here. Breathe deep. If you need something to take your mind off your toes, you can swim your fingertips behind you. Interlace the fingers. Press down to the earth. Find a big chest opener. Lift through the heart space. Big breaths in and out. One more. Big breath in and out. You got this. On your exhale, come forward, release the toes, bang them out. Ah, oh, feels good when the blood gets flowing again, huh? All right, we're going to come to a seat. Find your way to a seat and bring the soles of the feet together. Walk the heels in toward the body. Grab the shins lightly. Take a big breath in, lift through the heart space, maybe look up and back. Exhale, chin to chest, round the back, release. <sighs> Inhale, we look up, pull the heart space through. Exhale, release. Inhale, back to the top. Exhale, release. <sighs> Inhale, to the top. Exhale, release. <sighs> Back to the top one last time. Exhale, release. Let the body hang. Take a big breath. Come back to a nice tall seat. Big breath in. On your exhale, hinge at the hips. Take the elbows out wide and come to a fold. You can grab the toes here if you'd like. Find whatever feels good. Once you've found that length in the spine, Feel free to soften. Drop the head slightly. Breathe nice and deep. Big hip opener. You can use those elbows to open through the hips, pressing down on the shin or the knee. One more big breath in and out. And press yourself back up to a seat, nice and slow. Beautiful, you might need to grab the outside of the knees, bring the knees together. We're gonna come long ways on our mat. And we're gonna take this right down to the mat. So come on down and bring your knees with you if you'd like. Give yourselves a hug, a little rock. If you haven't done yoga outside, I highly advise it. It's beautiful to lay and look up at the trees until, of course, the pines start to drop on you, right? This is why I wore a hat. Come to stillness. Separate the knees a little bit and find some circles of the knees, big circles. Whatever direction you choose to go first. Inhaling as you roll toward your chest. Exhaling as you release. 
Take a pause, take it to the other side. Come back through center. Give yourselves a hug. On your exhale, plant the feet. Hip distance apart. And we're gonna take that figure four stretch or modified pigeon. Ooh, wind is really kicking up here. This is gonna get fun, kids. I feel like we're gonna get rained on, so let's see how long we can stick with it. All right, here we go. Start with your right leg. Bring the right ankle over the left knee. Flex the right foot. Open the right knee. Open, open, open. Feel that opening in the hip. If that's enough, stay there. Otherwise, you can interlace those fingers, bring them behind the left hamstring, and draw the left leg toward the chest. Nice and gentle, though. The toes on the left can release and relax. Right foot is flexed. That protects your knee. Try to relax the shoulders, even though they are not on the ground. Breathe. On your exhale, feel the hip open. One more big breath in with the wind. Exhale, release that foot to the mat and we'll release the right foot as well. We'll take it to the other side. Left foot is flexed, comes up and over the right knee. Open the left knee. Beautiful, find that opening in the left hip, flexing the left foot. And again, you have an option here to interlace behind the right hamstring and gently pull back toward the chest to deepen that stretch. Release the right toes. Big breaths in and out. Relax the shoulders. One more breath in and out. On your exhale, release the foot, followed by the other foot. Beautiful. Alrighty, take that left leg long. Bring the right knee into the chest, give it a little hug, and then we'll extend that right leg long up to the sky. Maybe grabbing behind the hamstring, behind the calf, grabbing the toes, whatever works for you. Point and flex the foot. Maybe circle the ankle. And bring that knee back into the chest, give it a hug. And release right leg long, we'll bring the left knee in. Give it a hug, give it a squeeze. Ah, and then extend the left leg long. Point and flex. Maybe circle the ankle. And circle the opposite direction. Bring the knee back into the chest. Give it one more hug. Nice. Bring both feet planted, hip distance apart. Knees are up. Take the arms to goal post position, and then we will heel toe the feet out to the edges of your mat. So heel toe them out wide. Big breath in. Exhale through the mouth. Release the tension. Big breaths in. Big breaths out. Make the next in breath a really big one. And on your exhale, Drop your knees to the right, gaze to the left. Inhale, back to the top. Exhale, twist and gaze to the right. Finding your windshield wiper, inhaling as you rise up with the knees. Exhale as you drop the knees and twist. 
If it feels comfortable, you're gazing in the opposite direction. If that doesn't feel good, by all means, eliminate twisting the neck. Whatever feels good here. wherever you're at on uh, the next time you exhale and drop those knees drop them and hold really relax relax the fingers and the arms release the shoulders Another big breath in and out. Slowly let the knees rise back through center. Exhale, drop them to the other side. And hold. Relax. Release tension, shoulders back, head, neck, arms are soft. Two more breaths. And bring the knees back through center. Beautiful. Find the organic movement here that feels good. If you want to roll along the sacrum. And then bring the knees into the chest. Give yourselves a big hug. Hmm. Take a big breath in. And on your exhale, let the legs go long. We're coming into Shavasana. Close your eyes. And your legs can come out long, or you can keep the feet planted with the knees to the sky. Arms come out to your sides, palms face up. Roll the shoulders back. Relax and release. Beautiful. If you haven't already, if you're comfortable, big breath in through the nose. Let it go through the mouth. with eyes closed and a completely relaxed body. Return to the natural breath. Let go of any tension you might be holding in the larger, strong muscles of the body that worked so hard today. Give yourselves a pat on the back for showing up on the mat, for showing up for yourself, and for showing up for me. I thank you for being here today. Our practice is so important. You are so important. Relax. Find your peace in Shavasana. You may remain in Shavasana as long as you'd like, or begin to wiggle the fingers and toes, roll the ankles and wrists, and when you're ready, make your slow transition to one side, 
bringing your arm up over, under your ear for a pillow. sounds of nature. That'll bring us back, right? Vroom, vroom with the motorcycle. Begin to slowly, with your eyes closed, press yourself back to a seat. Find Sukhasana. Easy pose where we began class. Skies are getting dark, my friends. Eyes are closed. Gently open your eyes. Welcome back, welcome back. Big inhale all the way to the top. Exhale, rain it back down. Literally, it's starting to drizzle. What great timing. Take a big inhale all the way to the top. Exhale, hands to heart center. And as you go forward today, my friends, may you have health, peace, love, safety, calm, and grounding. And your thoughts, in your words and in your heart from my heart to yours with so much love and so many wishes namaste thank you for joining me today please click on the subscribe button below so you are notified of new videos as they come around on youtube i will keep them fresh i'll keep them fun we'll keep them coming Thank you so much. Namaste. Have a beautiful day. I hope the sun is shining where you are.